today I'm going to be showing you how to do this awesome Halloween manicure. So if you want to see how to do it, keep watching. You will need base coat, top coat, orange nail polish, purple nail polish, green nail polish, black nail polish, a liquid latex, in this case I'm using Simply Peel, some striping tape or nail vinyls, sponges, and this is really optional, but I think it looks better using makeup sponges. A cleanup brush. This is just the e.l.f. concealer brush. And you will need some acetone to clean up. So you're going to start with your natural nail and then apply one thin coat of base coat. Then once your base coat is dry, you can go ahead and apply whatever color nail polish you want. I'm going for a Halloween look, so I'm going to use orange, purple, and green. So I'm just going to apply a thin coat of that, and then this one is a little bit sheer, so I'll let it dry, and then I'm going to come back and add a second coat. So now I've painted all my nails. And I'm going to take my cleanup brush and a bit of acetone on it, just dab it off a little bit, and I'm going to go around the cuticles and clean up any little areas that might not be perfect that I want to clean up. So it's really simple. All you do is take your little brush and go around very slowly. And just take off the extra nail polish. Okay, so I'll show you again on my middle finger. So I just take my brush, get right up to the cuticle line, and just brush the polish right away. And then you can go and do that on the sides to make the sides even. And you can basically do it however far you want to. Okay, so I'm going to finish cleaning up and come back. Okay, so once my polish is dry, I'm going to quickly add my top coat because when we add our nail vinyls or striping tape, you don't want it to pull up your base. So it's always a good idea to put on a layer of fast drying top coat. So when your top coat is completely dry, I'm just going to take an ordinary nail polish bottle and I'm going to take my little roll of striping tape and I'm just going to stick pieces onto the cap and then take my nail um, clipper and just clip little pieces like that and I'm going to do that all around the cap. So now I have two caps full, and the next thing I'm going to do is take my liquid latex product, okay, and I'm going to take my first finger, and I'm just going to paint this right around the edge, so when I put my black polish on top, it doesn't get all over my skin. Now, if you don't have this, you can use tape or another liquid latex. Um, I find this one works the best, the best, but you can use whatever one you like. So now I'm going to let this dry and when I come back we will start the design. So once my liquid latex is pretty much dry, I'm going to take my striping tape 
and put it on in rows. Now you want to press it down as best as you can so the polish doesn't seep under. Now you want to try to make these as straight as possible. I know that can be kind of difficult, but it gives you the best results. So now I'm just going to finish putting on my striping tape and I will come back. So once I have all these on, I'm going to take my black nail polish and my cosmetic sponges and I'm just going to take one off like this, okay, and now I'm going to take my black nail polish, if I can get it open, and I'm going to take this nail polish and I'm just going to paint a tiny little patch of it right on to the makeup sponge. Now I'm just going to keep dabbing this on my nail until it is fully opaque. So this is why we put the liquid latex on. So I'm going to take this and just dab the black right on. Now this black isn't really opaque so now I'm going to take my sponge and just take a little bit more black polish paint that on and then I'm just going to sponge it on and I'm going to keep doing that until it's fully opaque so once I'm happy I'm just going to take the tape and peel it right off revealing stripes now I'm just going to put my striping tape on a little cotton ball so then I'm just gonna keep peeling them off and it's really important to make sure that you're peeling them off in order if you don't peel them off in order then it's not going to reveal a nice peel now you could do two at a time um, you can do one at a time whatever you like best Okay, so now that I have all my stripes off, I'm going to just take my fingers and peel off the liquid latex. And as you can see, there is barely any mess. Okay, so now I'm going to take my little cleanup brush here, dip it in a bit, bit of acetone. Oops. Okay. And I'm just going to dip the extra off. And now I'm just going to go around the cuticle and clean up any bits of black that the Simply Peel did not take care of. Okay, so now I'm going to let this finish drying and come back. So now I went ahead and I did both of these fingers so now, when they're dry, you're going to take your quick dry top coat, and it's really important to make sure that your nail polish is dry. Then you're going to take your top coat and apply a generous coat of top coat, okay? And you're going to do that on this nail, too. So yeah, I hope you like this video and thanks for watching. Bye!